Testing, 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 testing. It's your 1876 Agar Boss here today again with another banging video. Yes, uh, we are on a farm today. We're gonna pick some exotic fruits and explore our exotic fruit nurseries. And so we have here on the farm. Some lucky farmer today is going to have 2,000 coconut palms to plant out in their farm today this is what 2000 coconut look like and we have a nursery of about 15,000 coconuts here on the farm we have approximately 200 237 acres you know picking exactly the fruit is my favorite thing to do coming to you today cool as this ginger cat on the strawberry guava tree today yes you know we're gonna explore today we're gonna pick some exotic fruits and also we're going to our nurseries to show you what we have growing on there in the meantime we're gonna enjoy some exotic fruits right this is a strawberry guava cultivars here from the farm i enjoy eating them so much yes even the cat too so the mulberries and this is the achacha tree coming into production pretty soon different stages phases of fruits on here and it's so nice so delicious one of my favorite fruit here on the farm is get rained water from the top of that greenhouse and it's as a different crops on it so nice so lovely rollinia right here I can remember falling from the Rolinia tree just last month. Yes, and this is our mystery fruit for the day. This is a plant of it and the fruit I showed. And we're gonna go over to the nursery now pretty soon. Yes, it's a beautiful tropical day here on the farm. And these are uh, pineapple guava. You know, this variety is the yellow one fijo and we also have the lime green one that i'm looking to get on the farm this is a yellow var variation of it and we basically have some tall trees in the nursery of our pineapple guava cultivar so it's one of the highly demanded plant we have the nursery in the nursery we have uh, approximately 21,000 different seedlings in here from large stock to small stock and this is a rambutan and also a long gun right here uh, ice cream bean ingas as well yes 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 all right mr maestro could you please um change the music for me please and thank you yes and these are my uh, lovely carambola sweet star fruit sweetest nicest one that you will ever find yes very lovely and is in high demand as well very prolific tree fast growing and it fits your farm and your backyard space as well we're going all the way up there right we have approximately a thousand of them and these are our nutter fruit or another fruit of food coloring this is used to create a lipstick they call it the lipstick fruit also i wouldn't want to try this because i will definitely look like a clown going to the rodeo show yes right here are our suriname cherries these are suriname cherries and nicely in season and pretty interested taste tasting cherry here it's not so fly out the palate it doesn't fly out the palate really well but it's one for someone that likes to have exotic trees yes yes going along here all the way going all the way up is our mountain sap yes a mountain sap fruit which is um, a powerful antioxidant powerhouse and we have a lot of them here in the nursery as well yes together with our a raza or amazon guava right here going all the way up they make an excellent combination for a drink that surely have you coming back for more yes looking nice looking lovely 
very tall trees here inside the nursery and adjacent to these are our oval pink guava this is one of our another powerhouse guava um, cultivar here that we have on the farm and we have a lot of them in the nursery due to our tree planting project that we have on stream So we have a lot of people requesting that they need guavas to make guava jelly um, for their processing plant or so. So this is driving the demand for local guavas now. Hence we have these trees inside the nursery. Here we have some java plum coming up. This were, these were given to me by a customer. So I'm extremely grateful for that and we'll just reward them for helping us at the research station. Yes. And these are some loquat Chinese plum. Interesting taste. Far plum. It's very nice. Unique taste. Here we have some strawberry guava here coming up growing pretty nicely and it's extended all the way up there we have some nice plants growing here inside the nursery and these are my ice cream bean ingas and I can remember great times with these having them out in the fields we have some guinea as well and some star apples so sweet so nice so we have some lychees as well coming in coming up and our sweet tamarind is like no other the sweetest you can find around we have some plants still in the nursery and here we have some lemon drop or mangosteen which is very close to my achacha fruit right here yes you can call them cousin these are the achacha row it's going all the way down there lovely lovely yeah looking lovely coming up here we have some dwarf june plums coming up in strong numbers as well they're looking really nice over this side are the tall plums tall june plums major more people like the tall june plums than these one these is a aki here we have the hockey fruit right here going all the way up it was brought to Jamaica by Captain Bly yes with the breadfruit but these aren't breadfruit these are these are two nice bread nut coming up yes so we are we are up to full capacity outside is full the nursery is full. We have other areas that are also full to the brim to the maximum. This is the second nursery. You have some nutmegs here coming up nicely. It's one of the most highly demanded demanded plant that we have here in the nursery. Here we have some peanut butter fruit snails absolutely enjoy them guys um, as you can see the, the appearance on the leaves they're looking chewed and bent and bitten in every way these are some pandapples going all the way back out they're coming up pretty nicely we have um, some long and seedlings here also we have strawberries these aren't for sale as yet 
but we are doing an experiment on them to see how best our local farmers can work with them. Yes, these are apples, or common apples, Sucidium malescens, or Jamaican apples, so some people might say it in its entire row right there. We have mangoes. We got these mangoes here, and this is a curry and a julie. That I have placed here. So I'm going to look and see if this has taken and it has it's growing a nice little sprout here. guys can see really coming up nicely in different phases of growth on here We also grab avocados, jackfruit, and just to name a few. And our mystery plant is actually our grandidia. Our locals call them grandidilla. Pretty much grown up. I was grown up on these vines. They pretty much grow wild out there in the area that I'm from. Right? So I was speaking these from a very tender age. So this is the appearance of the fruit. It's here, it's M6 box. Agribos, I'm out for now. Thank you for watching.